Hi, it's Katie from Oddly Chic, and many of my readers have been asking me to post some things about makeup or product reviews, how-to guides, etc. So I thought, perfect, I'll start filming a couple of videos, put them up on YouTube, and put them on my Modly Chic blog. So I'm going to start filming videos for Modly Chic. I'm not sure how often I'm going to do it, but um, I'm excited. So the first I'm going to do is a series, um, and it's going to be basically on how to apply eyeshadow using e.l.f.'s super, super cheap $5 beauty encyclopedia um, for the eye. So this palette is perfect, I think, because it offers like a wide variety of basic shades. Um, it's got, you know, this is a white. It's got a, a light gray, a kind of silvery, dark um, gray. Um, it's got all your brown shades. It's got a green, slightly green. This is a blue. So it's really nice. It comes in this case. I've reviewed that before. Um, it's really great, easy to use, and it's only $5, so that's really cool. So we're going to do a couple... Um, posts on that. Um, this is the first one today. It's kind of a basic, um, just browns and tans. So stay tuned. Hope you enjoy. And let me know if you have any questions. You can find me at modlychic.blogspot and of course here on the channel. Okay. You want to start on the eyelid, right? And then apply just a basic top coat. Um, I like this color here, which is kind of like the basic um, light beige. So you just want to put it on your brush, apply to the eye area, apply to both sides evenly. Okay, now that you've primed your eye, just the basic eyelid, what you can do is you can add a lighter color up here to kind of make your eyes pop a little bit more. So I'm going to go ahead and add this white color here, um, just to the top parts. Obviously making sure to blend it all in so that you don't look like a clown. Okay, so now you've got your eye basically eyes basically primed, right? You see the little bit lighter shade up there, the tan there. The next thing you want to do is take a smaller brush, maybe one about this size, um, and do the crease of your eye. So you want to take a slightly darker color than what you did for your base. Um, I like this color here, which is slightly darker, but not too crazy. And all you want to do is put it in the crease of your eye. So right where, like when you open your eyes, right where that line automatically forms. You can do it with your eyes slightly open if you want, or pull it to the side. So there, it should be a just slightly darker color in there, in that crease area. And that's going to create just a little bit of dimension. Next, what you want to do is take also a smaller brush. I like this size brush. It's very small, it's pretty easy to use, and you're going to want to just make a triangle in the corner of your eye here with a darker color to kind of make your eyes go bigger, kind of pop a little bit more. Um, for that, I like to use this color here, the dark brown. Um, I think it works really well in that, and you don't want to put this on too heavy on your brush, because if you do, and then you put it on your eye, and it's crazy, and then you've got a lot of darkness everywhere. So just take a little bit. Doing. Just kind of create that corner, that little triangle there in your eye. You can draw that line a little bit into the crease if you want to, so that you just have a nice like contour. You see that there? We fix this side a little bit. Okay, now you can see a pretty direct set of lines. So what you want to do is go back and take your brush that you used for the primer, take a little bit of the primer again, and just kind of run from the inside of your eye out, and just kind of blend together, so that it should create a slightly softer look for you. So that it's a little more blended, a little more together. See, so we've got it all blended nicely together. 
and then you can just apply mascara if you want to or what you can do to make them pop a little bit more is to apply just a basic line on the outside of your eye and you can actually use the same color that you used for the corner um, so I like a brush like this when I don't want to make it too like exact I'm a little bit more um, a little lighter And just apply to your eye like so apply to both eyelids see pretty basic pretty easy and then you're gonna apply mascara right now I'm using the refine the lash by um, Maybelline. I like it. It works pretty well. I have pretty long lashes, so I don't really need to too much in terms of like adding length. Because they are so long though, I do have to be careful not to get them everywhere. And you just want to make sure you don't have any extra powder anywhere. And ta-da, you're done. See?